Hey guys, Greg here. I wanted to uh, to go over Bitcoin a little bit, and uh, actually, I just wanted to go into the WXY waves and uh, why I think it's a total pain in the ass to uh, trade these waves. And just briefly, just to show you some stuff that really can go on with Bitcoin. Uh, I don't know if my count's correct in this complex uh, wave four correction that Bitcoin is doing. So let me go out to the uh, 30 minute chart. Like, just to give you an idea of the complexity, uh, this WXY right here. So there's a big on this fourth wave. There's a big WX right here. And then a Y. And then this would be within that one, this is a W, X, Y, because there's no divergence on that move. But there's divergence on this one. So there, this is an A, B, C move up to that X. So now we're in this area on Bitcoin. This is why, this is why you know, guys that say they trade this, I, I just think they're, they're, you know, I don't know how they do it. Um, support and resistance level, I guess you use other confluence. And then you have, um, so it's coming down for this Y potentially. And then within that Y leg, there's a lower sequence W, X, Y that's coming down. So there's no, um, see, there's no divergence on these moves. So this is a W, X, Y within that one, a lower sequence. No divergence on that move. So there's a, this is a W probably a W, X, Y type move. And then this move, if you go even closer, this, this move, um, it could be, it could be, uh, either an ABC. It might be an ABC move. You know, it might it might be an ABC move. So now in this move, it's either going to be it's going to be this. It could be this, which would be a cleaner move down for an A, up for B, and then down for C. Which would be ABCs are clean moves in my opinion. You can track them pretty easy and just you know you can see it. But this could this could be a three way move again, where you have a another W X and Y. And the reason that's an issue is say, this could be a three-way move. Like here, you might have an, an A, B, C like that. And then over in this X wave, you'll have another three-way move where you might have, uh, you might come up for an A, down for a B like that. And you might get, you might get an expanded flat type move like that, A, B, C. And then uh, over here in the Y, you can get a triangle or, uh, you know, uh, you can get a zigzag like that and down. And then you can have Bitcoin, when it goes to complete this WXY wave, it can go down like that and then back up and swing back down, pump back up, swing back down, pump up a little bit. You know, this can be another, you know, move where it's uh, more of a, uh, you know, maybe even a running flat like that. So this is an expanded. So you get a zigzag and then an expanded flat and then, you know, a running flat. Or the C goes down there. So, all right, guys, I just want to so show you uh, something about the WXY waves. Why, if you're, if you're in there, you know, uh, unless you use another types of confluence with support and resistance, the BPBR and things like that, it's, it's a very frustrating place to be trading because, you know, this is actually something, if this is a WXY wave and this is coming down to complete this W wave, then it's going to be going into an X, possibly of an X wave. And this, this could just drag out for like another day or two. And this could drag out for another day or two over here. So this actually, this whole move could take Bitcoin a week. All right, guys. Thanks for watching my video. Peace.